I'm going to show you how to make calzones. This is the bre refrigerated bread dough recipe that I made the other day. It should be up before this one. You just take your little ball, and I'm pressing it out on a greased seal pat. You know, work with your pizza dough and spread it out. Make them big as little as you want. I've got my oven preheated to 450 degrees. And when you take your dough ball, if it's been in the refrigerator, you need to let it set for about, I don't know, about 20 minutes. Let that, get, that chill get off of it before you start working with it. Okay, we're going to take us a little marinara sauce, pizza sauce, or spaghetti sauce, whatever you use. Little or as much as you want. This is some sausage that I cooked up. Some onion. You put whatever toppings you like. Some bell pepper. Some pepperoni. Some ham. With a little bit of shaved Parmesan cheese. A little bit of Italian seasoning, some mozzarella, you just want to take your dough over, put it over your toppings, then when you get to the edge, you just want to take your two and just roll it, give it a good roll, and I'll come back and I'll, I'll I'll cramp it real good. Okay, you're just taking your, your extra dough and just folding it, folding it in. So that way, it won't leak out all those goodies. And I'm going to slide this on a greased cookie sheet. And then start on my other calzone. Okay, now we're going to brush it with a little bit of egg wash. To make them real pretty when they come out. Then I'm going to sprinkle a little bit of Italian seasoning on top. Into the oven 450 degrees for about, I don't know, 15 to 20 minutes. You'll know when it's done. When the dough ain't doughy no more. Calzone just came out of the oven. I let it sit for a few minutes before I slice into it. A little bowl and put some extra marinara sauce in for dipping. And there you have it, calzones. And it's because mine were so big, they took about 20 minutes. You just want to make sure your dough is done and it's not doughy inside. 